Is oh. that is that a flashlight over there? Oh, it oh. is a flashlight. Crony notices a flashlight and she picks it up. Can I just kind of use this to look for anything in the nooks and crannies in this yes. library? You swing your flashlight around the walls of the library, hoping to see something in the darkness, but you quickly find out that it is a UV flashlight and reveals the word <gasps> hussy on the library walls. Hussy? hussy? What's hussy? What does hussy mean? Hussy, hussy? <laughs> Uh, maybe don't use that word, child. What? Yeah. Why? <laughs> Wait, what is it? I, I, I don't know, but I feel like it's that... not a good word. Oh, okay. It's a very mean word, my darling daughter. Do not worry about it. Oh, okay. I'm going to tell you a little bit of tidbit. Maybe it's related to this case, but it does not leave this room. I, Nerissa, is actually working for me as a member of Advent because she is under debt. And she is under debt because she had slept with my <gasps> gang member, Shiori. And while she did <gasps> sleep with Shiori, she stole something from Shiori. And so Shiori asked me and my father to confront her. And now she is working under Advent as a debt. So, I am concerned she... the same thing has happened to you, Cecilia. Is she are the hussy? Sure? Are I you sure anything was stolen me? from you? Yes. That is what I'm wondering. Uh, yeah. But... In the in the library, yeah. there was some hidden documents that Advent sent over, it seems like. Those Advent guys are Threats. mean. Threats towards Look, justice. Man. Both Advent yeah. and Justice are gangs. We all send threats to each other, but there was a truce put on tonight. But why the was hussy, it hidden right? then? Excuse me? You're the hussy. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. I, uh, I feel like we should give some like context. That. Uh, oh. When I used my UV flashlight, there was the word hussy written on the <laughs> library wall. The frick? Yeah, I heard a Someone story heard about on you. on the library wall? Man, what does that have to do with me? I heard a story about you from Bibu. I honestly oh. sensed it myself. Yeah, you and, uh, that, uh, who, what, the one that talks to ghosts, yeah. Oh, yes, Shiori, our past. I guess since Bijou is dead, there's no issue with me talking about it, but I was on hard times, so sadly I had to resort to stealing from people. Not my proudest moment, but we all have our ups and downs. I made a mistake, simple and clear, and I am paying for it every single day. But didn't you, like, do something strange with her? We slept together, yes. I don't wish to remember <gasps> it. I don't even remember that Damn. night. It's, All it's I remember is waking point. up in confusion. It was many years ago. Uh, but that many years for... ago, that was my innocence. Yes, I understand. I'm sorry. But you you were you were already over the age of 25. So get over it. I mean, don't get over it. But wow. you know, stop. stop. Whoa, was yeah, this non-consensual? No, it was very consensual. The only uh, non-consensual part was uh, me stealing from her, which understandably was she a bad thing for me to do. Playing. She's downplaying everything. This either, has either to way. do with what's at what's going on right there now. There is something this is at personal stake, though, drama. because now Biju is dead, and oh, Biju is not quite a vagrant. Is that what you did That's with Sabina last night? You. you took her yeah. away and you... Oh! Play in the field with her. Oh. No, did you no, also no. sleep with the green woman? Oh. No, 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 no. I mean, I couldn't no, find no, no. you, Cecilia. <laughs> well, oh. conversation, guys. Can two... Perhaps there are marks on your body for us to confirm. Okay, what? so me and Cecilia were at the bar bar, and it wasn't on purpose. We just so happened to be in the same place at the same time. While we were drinking, we ended up chatting. She was uh, talking about some particular woes to me that I don't know if she wants me to disclose. I will leave to her. And I gave her some advice. We parted ways, and that was it. We parted ways at about 3.30. We were both in good condition and then went our separate ways. Afterwards, I had the misfortune of running into Elizabeth. Who yeah, was, I was inquiring to, to me about and then CC. I find you, and then I and then I, I get worried, and then I'm like, well, you, you, you've probably taken her. Because <laughs> you're at the bar. Huh? I you did take her technically. 
Well, no, she left the bar bar. I didn't take her anywhere. She came there of her own volition and left of her own will. She didn't tell me anything, but I kind of presumed that she was coming back to help set up for the rest of the party. I went home and I woke up this morning with a big hangover home, which is not here, by the way. This is not a home. A home is somewhere else. Hmm. But Cece, you, you didn't drink that much last night. Not only that, you're German. So were you really hungover? I'm quite confused because you left seeming quite sober. No, I was... I actually don't remember, but I'm... The fact that I don't remember must mean that I have must have drank a lot. Because, you know, we talked I about mean, you were things. really sad. I was really mm. sad.